Hello everybody, don't adjust your sets. I'm not Santa Claus, nor am I the Grinch that stole Christmas, but this is a holiday version of the Rail Splitter Athletics Report. You know, all of the student athletes are uh, pretty much scattered to the four winds now. Most of them have gone to their uh, homes, where they, wherever they may be throughout the world. And uh, with that, things are quiet on the LMU campus. But, you know, in recent weeks, we've had a lot to do with some of the area children who don't uh, have it as fortunate as some of the student athletes at Lincoln Memorial University. And tonight, we're going to focus on that. Uh, most of you know of the ROHO organization that uh, is uh, strictly uh, in the area to focus on the needs of the needy children. And each year, they uh, have a fishing tournament the first weekend in May to provide proceeds to help uh, buy needy children around Christmas time clothes and toys that they wouldn't otherwise have. And several years ago, the Lincoln Memorial University Athletics Department was uh, fortunate enough to get involved with that cause to help those uh, young children throughout the area find those clothes and toys around Christmas time. And tonight we will focus on that. We're going to go to a break and when we come back, we'll tell you all about this year's Rojo Shopping Spree. Back after this on the Rail Splitter Athletics Report. Sigma Communications is your local radio and television stations bringing your local information, local news, and the best music from yesterday and today. Sigma Communications was established in 1987 on the campus of Lincoln Memorial University. Since then, we have been involved in community events and other projects. Sigma Communications is not only your local radio and television stations, but we are a learning facility aimed at educating students in the field of broadcast communications. Sigma Communications, not just the great building with satellites that sits on the hill. We are now MediaStream, bringing home to you more and more improvements. As your hometown team, we're dedicated to bringing our friends and neighbors more service upgrades than ever before. Always available 24-7 customer service and technical support. 30-day money-back guarantee on services. Improved bundles that will save you money. Get ready to do more of the things you love with the people you love and with savings you'll love. Call 1-800-392-2662 for details. MediaStream, bringing it home to you. Bringing it home to you. Since 1973, DeRoyal has been a leader and an innovator in manufacturing products for the healthcare industry. DeRoyal supplies more than 20,000 products and product lines such as acute care, orthopedics, wound care, and trauma. DeRoyal is proud to be the largest supplier of orthopedic soft goods to clinics and hospitals in the nation. Since its start in Tazewell, Tennessee, DeRoyal has grown to open factories in over 29 locations worldwide and employs over 2,000 people. DeRoyal, a name you can trust and an employer you can count on. Looking for efficient, compassionate, and comprehensive health care for you and your family? Visit University Medical Clinic. All providers are faculty members of LMU's DeBus College of Osteopathic Medicine and are board certified in their specialty. Multiple specialties available including family medicine, pediatrics, OBGYN, and osteopathic manipulative medicine with locations in Harrogate, Taswell, and New Taswell, and most insurance plans accepted. University Medical Clinic is here to serve you. Call 423-869-7193 for an appointment. University Medical Clinic. Rojo to me is, uh, you know, it, it just symbolizes what's what's uh, what's good with, you know, the Christmas season, the holiday season, uh, in terms of being able to, to give to others and and uh, uh, provide uh, kids who maybe don't have uh, an opportunity to have a, a great Christmas or a great holiday season a chance to do it. It's a, it's a opportunity for our kids and our, our athletic department and really the entire community to to give back and, and those that have a lot of uh, blessings and a lot, uh, you know. To, to give you are know, able to give back to, to some that are that are less fortunate so um, it's it's a great it's it's really what's good about the holiday season and uh, it's a great opportunity for our our staff and our players and and really the entire athletic department community as a whole. Well, one of the most rewarding things in coaching is the ability to interact in the lives of young people. Uh, in a lot of in a lot of jobs, you uh, you might not have the opportunity to go out into the community and, and see folks and, and, and quite frankly just try to help, uh, help other people out. So being able to make a difference in some of these kids' lives, not just for, you know, for us as coaches, but for our players, is just a, a, a tremendous opportunity that is, uh, is so very rewarding. And uh, it gives us also an opportunity to teach our players a little bit about about what it's like in other people's lives and and hopefully this carries over with with our kids in terms of of their desire and in, in wanting to help others out as well Rojo 
is a chance to make a difference in your community and reach out and give up some of your time. Well, it's the definition of Christmas for me. Uh, giving, you know, giving to people less fortunate, giving a little bit of yourself. That's what Rojo means to me. Oh, I, for me, Christmas season doesn't start until I do Rojo shopping. It's, um, it just really is a wonderful experience to know that I can um, help bring a smile to somebody's face. To me, it's just giving back to the community, giving kids what they wanted for Christmas. Um, it's a great experience for anyone who wants to give community service, so it's a pretty good experience. I enjoyed it. It helps me be more humble around the Christmas spirit and enjoy the holidays. Rojo is a good community service, and it makes me appreciate the gifts that I get. Uh, you get to go shopping with uh, less fortunate kids and you get uh, team bonding. You get to go with one, somebody on your team. I think it's good for us to be able to connect with little kids in the community and be able to help out for the less fortunate. I think it's really humbling for all of us athletes to do. So. All right, we're here with Bobby and Morgan, part of the women's basketball managerial staff. And what does Rojo mean to you guys? It means giving to those who are less fortunate and, you know, helping the kids let them have a good Christmas too. Yeah, just making sure that they get the toys and clothes that they wouldn't otherwise be able to get. And how does this affect you personally when you do this type of an event? I love doing this type of stuff, helping others, so this is, makes me, you know, happy. So. Well, when I was younger, my family went to programs like this, so it kind of reminds me of where I came from and helping those that were just like me. Hi, we're here with Alyssa Nelson, part of the women's basketball team. And what does Rojo mean to you? I'm um, just taking the time to help out kids. And how does it help you as an individual? It helps me to grow and know that like what I'm doing matters to other people. Good. And your name is Nathan? Eldridge. Eldridge. Yeah. And are you enjoying your time here with Rilissa? Yeah. Is she getting you all kinds of things that you want? Yeah. Well, good. So I'm glad you're having a good time. here with one of the volleyball players at LMU. Tell us what Rojo means to you. Um, Rojo to me means a chance to get back to the community and help out the underprivileged children that don't get to have Christmases like we take for granted and just feels good to give back and help little kids that are not as fortunate as we are. And how does it affect you as an individual? Um, it really makes me like um, not take for granted what I had as a kid because you don't realize how much you have until you realize what, how, what little everybody else has. Hi, we're here with Roger Vinoy, longtime women's basketball coach and now current athletic director at Lincoln Memorial University. What does Rojo mean to you? Well, it's hard to put it in words, uh, Matt. You've been here now uh, with this thing six, seven years, and uh, you know, I told one of the uh, uh, one of the guys out there that I don't really have to do anything anymore. It's kind of taken on a life of its own. We just uh, uh, offer the opportunity, and the athletes, you know, they're they're clamoring to come over. The coaches are are so involved and it's just really meaningful. It just really brings it to, uh, to life and uh, it's just, uh, just was an amazing morning. On a personal note, what does Rojo mean to you as an individual? 
Well, again, you know, we get to, to walk around with one child, and so it becomes very real with that one individual. And, uh, you know, with kids of my own and having kids, uh, obviously you can relate to them. So, again, very special, very special. All right, we're here with Elliot Roberts, one of the freshmen on the women's basketball team here at LMU. And what does Rojo mean to you? Um, it's just good to give during this season, just to see people happy. That's what it means to me. I just like seeing other people happy. So it affects you on a personal note, how? Um, it just warms my heart to see him enjoying picking out all this stuff, so. Okay. And this is Tyler. Tyler, what? Are you enjoying your time here with Elliot? Yeah. Is she getting everything that you want to get? That's great. Well, we hope you guys enjoy your Christmas time together in here and hope you can get everything you want. All right? We're here with Kiso Barnett, one of the managers of the LMU women's basketball team and close personal friend of Matt Acton. <laughs> what does Rojo mean to you? Rojo means everything to me. It's exciting to see the kids get what they need and some people, you know, are less fortunate than others, so it's always good to give back. And how does it affect you on a personal note? Personally, uh, I've been in a couple of those situations where I couldn't have what I wanted and um, it's nice to know that I'm in a position now to where I can give back to others. That's awesome. We appreciate your time, Kiso, and hope everything's going well. We're very thankful to be out here today. To me, Rojo means the real reason for Christmas, you know, helping people out, being thankful for the season. And it's a good opportunity for our students to take part and be a part of the community and be able to give back. And I want to wish you guys all a Merry Christmas. Thank you. I will help families adopt children from around the world and in our own backyard. I am teaching ethics to the next generation of lawyers. I will make a difference for the underserved of this region. I will be an advocate for my clients. As a prosecutor, I fought for those who couldn't speak for themselves. I'm a lawyer and professor. I will be a lawyer. I will be a lawyer. I will be a lawyer. I guess we'll take uh, Morty. Yes. Pick last. Ouch. A vault will put you back on top. Quenches and ah! kicks. Incoming! Yeah! Ah! Oh! You're a super soda mercenary. Ah! Vault. Drinks like a soda. Kicks like an energy drink. Get to it. History comes alive at the Abraham Lincoln Library and Museum on the campus of Lincoln Memorial University in Harrogate, Tennessee. Located 60 miles north of Knoxville and five minutes from the entrance of Cumberland Gap National Historic Park, the museum is home of one of the largest privately held Lincoln collections in the country. A place to learn and play. My museum includes interactive exhibits as well as special events and educational programs. For more information, go to www.lmunet.edu. We represent the Coke brand. We would like to sue Coca-Cola Zero. Would you say that we have a case? For what? For taste infringement. We want to just sue them back to the Stone Age to send a message that they're tampering with, really, the flagship of the company. It's one company. It's like you suing yourself. Yeah, but, but they're on a different part of our floor. Da, 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 da. I deal with life and death situations. We touch a lot of lives every day. 
People's lives are in your hands. I will be a nurse. I will be a nurse. Hi, we're here with a couple of the men's soccer players from Lincoln Memorial University and with their Rojo participant, River. What does Rojo mean to you guys? Uh, it's a really good opportunity for we like uh, go with the kids and get some toys and make some like better uh, Christmas for them. It's really good to help them. It's good to help people. It's really good. You can, we have the opportunity to help some people. Yeah. Are you doing? How's everything going with you, River? Good. Are you getting everything you want? Yeah. Well, that's great. We're here with the golf coach, the men and women's golf coach at Lincoln Memorial University. Tell me what you think about Rojo and what it does it mean to you. Well, this is a time of the year that we always look forward, me and my, myself and the golf team look forward to this time of year and coming over here and being with the kids and uh, it's just great fun and the true meaning of Christmas. Well, I think uh, with Rojo, I believe that it really just gives, puts things in perspective and, and just shows you how grateful we all are and to, to help others in this time of the year. Good morning here from Walmart with Rojo, and it's such a great day. I'm here, Mike Smith, with with Kenneth here. And Kenneth, how has it been a great day or a great morning to this point of being able to shop and enjoying the day? Yes, it has very much. You know, it, you see a lot of smiles, and it's such a great uh, it's such a great time to spend with everyone. And we we, we want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and enjoy a safe and uh, enjoyable holiday. And for some people, Happy Hanukkah. Rojo is an opportunity to spend time with people that I would normally not get to meet and enjoy a little bit of Christmas spirit. to me giving opportunities for kids around the area that wouldn't normally have a Christmas to give them something that means Christmas and make them feel special make them feel wanted it's an awesome opportunity for a lot of kids and I feel really blessed to be able to be a part of it um, this is my first time doing Rojo and I think it's a really awesome philanthropy that LME is able to be involved with um, over my years this is probably one of the coolest things we've got to do Oh, it just help. It helps tremendously. Giving back to the community, always helping uh, the kids who come to our games and shop, helping them shop for their Christmas gifts because not everybody gets these kind of opportunities, especially as young kids and uh, as and athletes for us to helping. So uh, just giving back and it's it's, it's, a, it's a good deed to, for the community. It really just uh, it makes you feel really good to give back to the kids that aren't as fortunate as you are and they get presents for Christmas that they normally wouldn't get and it really just brightens your day. Rojo is a great time to have fun with the local children from elementary schools and put a smile on their faces. Rojo to me is really special. I think it's the best community service event that we do as a team. 
and as an athletic department here at LMU, it's, it's an opportunity to interact one-on-one -on -one, uh, with the children in the community that, that need more, that don't have as much, that aren't as fortunate. It's an opportunity for us to really give back. I think it's, I think it's really a really cool experience, not only for our players and the department, but for the kids too. I think they get an opportunity to be around people they, uh, people they really look up to and respect and hold a high, high standard for. What does Rojo mean to me? Rojo is an opportunity for each of us to give back to the community, uh, to help underprivileged children have a better Christmas. Uh, I think sometimes we forget that the important thing is to give rather than to receive. Uh, and to be able to give back to the community for that reason alone uh, is something that I'm really excited and passionate about. Um, again, I just can't tell you how much I've learned from being here that just you don't want to take things for granted when you when you understand those things. Uh, again, I, I look forward to it every year. I thank so much for the organization that puts this on. Uh, and again, I hope each and every one of you have a happy new year, a Merry Christmas. Rojo is a great opportunity to help the community out and help out the little kids get things that they need. It's, uh, it's a very good experience for my teens because a lot of them don't uh, know this side of things and so it's really good for them to be able to help somebody else and to volunteer. We do a lot of volunteer hours, our teams do um, during the year anyway and this is the event that they look forward to the most. They talk about it from year to year. Um, the teams talk about Rojo and they can't wait for it uh, for the next year. As a team, uh, it shows that we're willing to give back to the community and uh, basic team bonding and showing the people and the fans that we're here for the support too and they support us. Merry Christmas. Uh, I was going to say Merry Christmas to everybody and the Rojo members and everybody helping out and to the kids that we're helping from the Bas LME basketball family. Happy Holidays. Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays from LMU Baseball. Happy Holidays. <laughs> Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays to everybody. Merry Christmas. Nestled at the foot of the Cumberland Gap, 
Lincoln Memorial University honors the vision and spirit of Abraham Lincoln. Lincoln's values are perfectly in sync with the modern educational experience at LMU. Our students find personal attention is a way of life and a way to success. If Lincoln Memorial University fits your vision of college, visit our website at lmunet.edu for more information. Sigmund Communications is your local radio and television stations bringing your local information, local news, and the best music from yesterday and today. Sigmund Communications was established in 1987 on the campus of Lincoln Memorial University. Since then, we have been involved in community events and other projects. Sigmund Communications is not only your local radio and television stations, but we are a learning facility aimed at educating students in the field of broadcast communications. Sigmund Communications. Not just the great building with satellites that sits on the hill. We are now MediaStream, bringing home to you more and more improvements. As your hometown team, we're dedicated to bringing our friends and neighbors more service upgrades than ever before. Always available 24-7 customer service and technical support. 30-day money-back guarantee on services. Improved bundles that will save you money. Get ready to do more of the things you love with the people you love and with savings you'll love. Call 1-800-392-2662 for details. MediaStream, bringing it home to you. Bringing it home to you. History comes alive at the Abraham Lincoln Library and Museum on the campus of Lincoln Memorial University in Harrogate, Tennessee. Located 60 miles north of Knoxville and 5 minutes from the entrance of Cumberland Gap National Historic Park, the museum is home of one of the largest privately held Lincoln collections in the country. A place to learn and play. My museum includes interactive exhibits as well as special events and educational programs. For more information, go to www.lmunet.edu. We certainly hope that you've enjoyed tonight's episode of the Railsplitter Athletics Report as much as uh, we have to be a part of the Rojo shopping spree. And uh, You know, with uh, all of the tragedy that took place up in Connecticut uh, some time ago, a couple of weeks ago, uh, this cause means even more to the Rojos and I'm sure to the Lincoln Memorial University student athletes, uh, the faculty and staff that were involved, and to the Frank White Academy. And I personally, as a Rojo member, would like to thank each and every one of you, as well as Sigma Communications, for going over and covering the event uh, to help this uh, cause be such a success. And hopefully next year it'll be even bigger. We strive to help more children every year, and we'll probably always keep that ticket at $150. But uh, if we can help more children, that would be even a greater, greater thing for all of us. And maybe puts us a little bit closer to what the spirit of Christmas is all about. From everybody, for everybody behind the scenes of the Rail Splitter Athletics Report from Lincoln Memorial University and on behalf of the Rojos, I'm Rusty Peace and we appreciate you watching. We'll see you in 2013.